Do you both play Numbots? Yes. yes. And do you like it? Yes. What's your favourite thing about Numbots? Uh, I like collecting coins and in the robot because I like buying people. Well, I like it because I like it a new level and I really want to see what the new level is like. I'm Greg McGill, I'm the Deputy Head Teacher here at Swallowfield Lower School, soon to become Primary School. So we've used Numbots now for about three years. What I really like about Numbots, it really develops that conceptual understanding, uses so many different ways of teaching the children different methods, um, be it with their time, their addition and subtraction, using the rulers. There's so many different concepts that, that Numbots are exploring. Really supports that understanding going forward when the children are completing a, a, a standardised assessment. The children seem really engaged, they love playing it at home. Um, the displays that we've set up around the school kind of really um, picks up on that engagement and really makes them tell their friends what uh, stage they're at and where they want to go next, how many stars they collected um, and how, how they're getting on in general really about Numbots and the big buzz around it. And as I say, that's getting more and more so every year. My name is Carol Potter and I am a Year 2 teacher and a Key Stage 1 leader. Those small steps in Numbots really helps all of the children to access it and then that means that that builds that fluency that they can then apply in the classroom. I think it has a really positive impact on fluency. I think because they're so keen to play it, they're so engaged with the game side of it, they want to play it and it definitely has improved fluency. We've done some um, problem solving recently um, and you can tell that they're drawing on that fluency that I, if I know my number one's to ten then I can use that in this problem solving context and I'm quite confident that Numbots has played a part in that because it's gone right back to the basics, it's those small steps and it's really embedded that number fluency in them so I think it's had a really positive impact. Because we're a um, maths mastery school, we like to show the children number in lots of different ways, different rep representations. And it's nice that Numbots mimics what we teach at school. So you've got a bar model, you've got the part, part, whole, you've got blocks, all sorts of ways. And I think that's good just to show it in different contexts. So it's not that they're jumping through a hoop for the next level, they're really demonstrating their understanding. So the confidence is the biggest thing as a parent. Um, that uh, the different representations of the questions. So I remember when you first started it and the ones with the number lines, the jumps, absolutely threw you. And you're like, what's that? But then now you're doing it with the threes and it makes him, I'm, I'm just watching it like over the top of his shoulder, he's becoming more aware of different representations. He should practice numbers and it makes him better at maths. I just feel happy doing it.